Hey, what's happening, guys? How are you doing? It's me, Epic Gamer Josh. Welcome back to the channel. And in today's video, as you can see, I'm in a rather wet, gloomy, cold, grey, miserable Huddersfield because I'm doing yet another match day vlog. Uh, this is the first match day vlog of 2022. I was here back in 2021 to vlog Huddersfield Town's victory against West Brom. But today I'm doing it again, but this time it's FA Cup action. Huddersfield Town versus Barnsley, FA Cup fourth round, and I'd like you to come and join me. So then guys, today's vlog is Huddersfield Town versus Barnsley. There's three reasons to why I'm vlogging this match today. One is because it's the FA Cup. Two, it is um, West Yorkshire versus South Yorkshire. And three, I mean, tickets are only a tenner. Football for a tenner. Can you go wrong with football for a tenner? Nah, 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 nah. nah. With tickets normally costing around £25, it is so nice to have, uh, you know, a ticket for a tenner. I mean, I don't know whether it's because they're desperate to get people into the stadium to fill the seat or whether, you know, um, because it is the fourth round of the FA Cup and it's, you know, West Yorkshire versus South Yorkshire with it being a local, well, not a local derby, but a derby of sorts. Um, but I don't know why they've done uh, match tickets for a tenner, but it is what it is. And I mean, it's a cheap, uh, cheap ticket. And uh, yeah, I mean, when I ordered the ticket online, um, I selected a really, really good seat right at the front row nearby the uh, dugout. So during the vlog, it'll be in, it'll be interesting to see some action from the um, yeah, from the dugout. <laughs> but anyways, guys, in today's vlog, I'll also be introducing uh, Staff Talk, which is uh, me with a piece of paper with some statistics that I've written down this morning for both teams and I will be basically uh, telling you some of the recent statistics and not just that but I'll also be predicting my result today when I get to the stadium. So guys, I'll see you for Stat Talk. So guys, like I said, um, in this vlog I'll be introducing something called Stat Talks where I sit somewhere, um, well obviously anywhere, but uh, today I'm sat in a bus shelter outside Huddersfield Railway Station because the weather is absolutely fucking glorious. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. It's West Yorkshire weather, it's always raining, always windy, always wet, wild, cold, grey, gloomy, whatever you want to call it. But today's, um, today I've got some stats about both of these teams, not just relating to uh, you know, the FA Cup, but also um, their stats in the last six games in all competitions. Well guys, this, this season's FA Cup is the 151st year of the FA Cup. I believe it's the longest running um, cup competition there is for football. Now, for those of you that don't know what the FA Cup is, the FA Cup is a is a um, tournament consisting of teams from all walks of football life, uh, from the highs of the Premier League to the lows of the local leagues. Um, I think uh, the FA Cup is open to um, tiers one to ten of the English football pyramid, and um, you know this season there's been 729 teams that have entered the competition. And you know, with it being the fourth round of the FA Cup, there are 32 teams remaining. So, guys, um, <clears throat> so Huddersfield Town last won the FA Cup in 1922, um, which is 100 years ago now. Wow, 100 years ago, jeez, seems like a long time ago. And Barnsley last won the FA Cup in 1912 which is uh, 130 years ago. But in the last, uh, in the last six um, games for Huddersfield Town, Huddersfield Town have recorded three wins, three draws and no losses whatsoever. They are on a um, unbeaten run, as it seems. Whereas Barnsley, on the other hand, has one, one win, 
zero draws and five losses. I mean, it's a bit of a shambles really, but I mean, Barnsley just full of shit. Uh, <clears throat> anyway, guys, the last, the last game between Liverpool and Barnsley at Orkwell ended in a one-all draw on the 4th of December, and their next game after today is 23rd of April. The one win in Bowers la in uh, Barnsley's last six games actually came in the FA Cup third round where they edged out um, Bower 5-4. And the last time Barnsley won a league game was on the 3rd of November. So that is absolutely shocking. Um, in the league, Barnsley are rock bottom of the championship with only two wins, eight draws and 18 losses. And Huddersfield are fifth, I believe. Um, and they carry a 13, 13 games won, 9 drawn and 8 lost. I mean, the statistics go in Huddersfield's favour. And to be quite honest, um, here is the prediction for today's match. I'm predicting a, a 3 nil win for Huddersfield. I mean, um, <clears throat> it is the FA Cup of course, so Barnsley might pull off a win, but... I don't see it happening, and if it does, I will be shocked. So then guys, um, that is it for Sat Talks, and I will see you whilst on the way to the stadium. So peace out guys, and see you soon. So then guys, after, um, after going for coffee in Huddersfield, um, I'm now walking the, well, the long way to the stadium, as, the, as they say. Um, it's not really town centre location for a stadium, it's a bit out and I don't know how long it's going to take me to walk, probably about 15 20 minutes. But I mean, uh, I'm feeling fat today, so I might as well just uh, walk, walk the entire way to the ground. Uh, the last time I got a bus, this time I'm walking. Yes, yes, you can call me fat because I am fat. But I'm happy, so let's. Uh, I don't. I don't even know what time it is to be honest. But uh, yeah, I mean, it's wet. It's windy. It's miserable. It's classic Yorkshire for you. And uh, yeah, it's going to take me a while to get to the stadium. So I think when I get to the stadium, I'll have another cup. I might have another coffee to warm me up. <laughs> Two hours later. Three hours later. Whew. I feel like I've been walking for hours on end here. I mean, I think by now I've probably lost about ten pounds just by walking to the stadium. Let me tell you, after match, I ain't walking back. I'm getting bus back. Two thousand years later. A few moments later. Finally, after a long walk from the town centre to the stadium, I finally made it. Whew. Right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a little rest about two minutes and then I'm going to head inside and find my seat and show you guys what view I have for today's match. When I put the ticket, it looks like I picked some very, very decent seats. These are put, these are really good seats. I mean, you get full on view of the pitch, and to be quite honest, I'm next to the dugouts. It's awesome, absolutely awesome. And I mean, I can't imagine having better seats, but the only problem is it's absolutely pissing it down. So I'm going to get really wet today. But it's all part of the fun and games here obviously in Yorkshire where I'm from um, no matter where you go in Yorkshire you're always going to run into rain uh, cold, wind, miserable, grey, gloomy skies and today makes no difference this is classic football uh, I mean the players are going to be slipping and sliding everywhere and it's going to get really wet and wild so guys I will see you ahead of kickoff and by the looks of it the, uh, the 
Barnsley fans over there are already making the noise. Huddersfield Town are winning 1 0. So if it stays like this, they'll go through to the fifth round of the FA Cup and they might even draw out a Premier League team. Um, Barnsley, however, on the other end of the stick, have been absolutely shocking and it's hard to it's easy to believe why they are 24th in the table, rock bottom. If they keep on playing like the way they're doing, they're going to end up being relegated to League One and they're going to end up being. Uh, you know, knocked out of the FA Cup but there's still the second half to come guys and I'm sure that um, maybe the second half might, be, might go in their favour a bit more but if not then they get knocked out of the FA Cup at this stage now because there's no replays this season if, it, if, um, if both Huddersfield and Barnsley draw it will go to extra time and it will also go possibly all the way to penalties. So, I mean, with it being the magic of the FA Cup, anything can happen in the second half. Huddersfield can score four quick fire goals, go 5 0. Uh, Barnsley could do a fighting comeback and beat Huddersfield. Which, which, if they do, then it would shock the town fit. Anyways, guys, uh, anyways, guys, it is 1 0 half time. I hope you're looking forward to the second half as I am, and hopefully, you'll enjoy what's on offer in the second half. So, guys, I'll see you all in the second half. 
two hours later. Two thousand years later. A few moments later. 13 Northern service to Sheffield via Barnsley. Hello guys, Dan is it for um, this vlog. Um, as you can see, this door won't fucking open. Open the door! Come on, open the fucking door! Fucking lousy bastards. Open the door! Oh well. Fucking idiots. Looks like I'm gonna have to go down here to end the carriage. <laughs> uh. So then guys, as I was saying before, uh, I couldn't open the door. Um, that is it for this match day vlog of Huddersfield Town versus Barnsley in the fourth round of the FA Cup. As you can see right now, I'm on my way home. Um, anyways, guys, I hope you guys have enjoyed the vlog. If you have, then don't forget to drop a like on on the on the on the vlog, and don't forget to come and subscribe to the channel if you are new. Um, I'm currently 61 subscribers away from the next target of 500 and you guys can help make that happen so if you are new to the channel or you've not yet subscribed then please come and subscribe to the channel to see more amazing content from me on a daily basis now once i reach that 500 um, subscriber target that i'm chasing after not only will i be able to create community posts um, where um, I can do polls and you know keep you guys up to date with what's happening on the channel but getting to 500 subscribers as well will allow me to thank you all in my own special way and that is to, um, to stream GTA 5 online for 24 hours I know it's a, it's a, man, it's a mad one I know but I will stream 24 hours straight as a thank you for getting me to 500 subscribers. Anyways, just before I go, just to recap, um, Huddersfield Town beat uh, Barnsley 1 0, so West Yorkshire won the derby today, but it was absolutely fucking freezing. Um, some, some of the um, highlights I couldn't recall because my fingers were literally frozen. Uh, I think uh, that serves me right for getting. Uh, for booking the front row seat when he ordered a ticket. Well, I wasn't really expecting for uh, for the um, for the weather to turn out as shite as it has been. But what do you expect? It is Yorkshire weather at the end of the day. Um, but yeah, I'm nice and warm now, and you know, I hope you guys enjoyed the stream, uh, enjoyed the vlog. Um, I I enjoyed the match. It was well worth a tenner. Some tense moments there, but. In the end, Huddersfield got the win, and they are through to the next round of the FA Cup. Well then guys, until, until next time, stay safe, stay positive, be epic, and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out guys, and thank you for watching.